Hey everyone, Scott from Photocrati here. I want to walk you through something um, that is uh, quite popular um, within the NextGen Gallery. And uh, in fact, there's a lot of third-party developers that are starting to build what I'm about to show you more often. So here is uh, a quick uh, tip. So let's say you um, don't are not a big fan of the built-in uh, modal windows, these pop-up windows when you click on the photo. We have a, a couple styles built in, but let's say you want something else, right? So let's say, for instance, you uh, are a big fan of the food box uh, modal pop-up because it's responsive, it has social capabilities, you can uh, color scheme it to match your site, things like that. So let's say you want to use that. Here is what you need to do to get started to do that. The first thing would be to visit your options panel for in the WordPress, uh, and I'm sorry, in the next gen gallery uh, section. So you can either go here on the left and go to options, or you can go up here to the top and go to options. And when you're in the options section, there is going to be a new place for you to add uh, or pick your uh, effect. So right here you have a tab that says effects. So you're going to pick that, and the default I have it set to shutter. That was my favorite. Um, so then you just hit none. That's all you got to do is hit none. It's going to turn off the effect, and I'll show you what I mean by that. So now if I refresh the, uh, the gallery I have here and I click, it's going to go to the photo. It's not going to go to a modal window. Let's go back. So obviously we don't want that. We want people to stay on the site, not leave the site. So what we're going to do is we're now going to activate the FooBox plugin. And let's activate that. Now I'm not going to change any settings. It's a fresh install. Um, I didn't put in any serial number, I didn't change any um, colors or anything, but let's refresh. And now, it's going to load the FooBox plugin, the default settings for FooBox. And the cool part is that now, um, not only is it, um, you know, a nice gallery that suits my needs, um, but I've got social, social sharing here, and it's responsive, which means on small browsers, it'll just shrink. Um, so that's pretty neat. And uh, it's as simple as that. So really, you got to remember to turn off the effect. That's the most important thing. So again, gallery, options. When you're in the option setting, you're going to pick the effect tab, which is here, and put the um, thumbnail effect to none. And then activate your third-party uh, plugin. So whether it's FooBox or Social Gallery or the, the Pinterest one or Pretty Photo or, or Fancy Box, whatever it is, Make sure that your uh, thumbnail effect is off so it's completely compatible. It doesn't um, you know, mess with your next-gen settings. So there you have it. That is how you um, um, uh, correctly uh, you know, turn off the, thumb the thumbnail effect to use a third-party effect.